Yes, what's up people, this is Alice Mins. We're gonna go ahead today and show you how to do a hairline enhancement uh, using the Hair Illusions uh, half, half fiber. And um, as you can see, uh, we have our uh, subject, our gentleman here. He has the receding on both sides. And um, we're gonna go ahead and, as you can see, we already have it marked off so that it can be as even as possible. I uh, can use a white, um, pencil, outline pencil or whatever you have and just uh, outline the area that you want to um, use as your, ha your, your hairline. And so we're going to go ahead first. We're going to use our IC uh, Poisoner Spritz. It's IC Poisoner Super Hold Spritz. This is one of the best spritz on the market uh, because uh, we've tried a, quite a few just to get the best one. This holds very, very well. We can get up to four days of use with this spritz. And so we're gonna use this one as our holding uh, spray. And uh, we're gonna start off by just giving that area, both areas, a light spritz. One of the reasons why I like this spritz also is because it goes on like a like a but Some like of a you spray. are using other types. But what um, this is basically what you want to do to cover that area. Okay, once you have that area covered. So let me show you got. Go ahead, use your dryer. Use your dryer to hold. Then take another layer of spritz on top of that. Use your dryer. A little bit more in that area, just to make sure. And you can feather off any loose debris. Now you get your outliner. Following your line.
Same way we did the other side, we're gonna do this side. A little spritz on that area. We'll take our card, mask off the area, apply our hair illusions to the area. Wash off your excess. Light spritz again. Grab the entire area. Just take your outliner. We're gonna outline just like we did on the other side. Don't press too hard, just go ahead and lay your outliner on the, on the area that you want to remove. Okay. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and make sure that this line is pretty much straight all the way around before we put our razor on it. And remember, we, we had some help because we were able to put an outline before we did the actual liner. And remember, don't dig too hard because you don't have to. And now we're going to go ahead and use our razor. And uh, we're going to use a light skim on the area. Just to remove the white. And anywhere where you didn't, you didn't get enough, you can always go back and touch that area up. You see here. Okay. Hit that. And slightly. Touch that line. Get it all the way around. Make sure to pull the skin tight because the uh, 
your um, your spritz may be kind of hard, so just make sure to pull the skin nice and tight. Be aware with you, with your light. You can just touch up that area. Back with your liner once again. When you're using your, your, your blade, always do a light scrape. You don't want to scrape too much, scrape too hard, cause any irritation to the customer. Okay? Anything, any buildup right here, just get a little your, your alcohol, extrinsic, and just wipe that off. Get close to it. Put a little astringent. Put a little astringent on your on your Q-tip. Just wipe around that whole line. Now I clean up the whole area. Even when we can see white. As I said, this is this um this spritz is very very heavy. It's a it's a very very full quality spritz, super whole, poison the IC, and it will hold for a very long time. So you want to make sure you clean the area up with. Once again, the other side. Just the side that we had to touch up. Just take your, your outliner. Clean the area up good. Q-tip. Yeah, area feel good. Right down your point real good. As you can see, we have the finished product. 